Well, today we're out at Rocky River and we're doing the gentleman's ride. Well, I'm here. Ortho, Carolina. Uh, how I got here, well, uh, let's go back a little bit. It's a ride where you start here at Rocky River and you ride to Sherman Branch on the road and then you ride back to get your car in the parking lot. So Rocky River is what, 15 miles, 14 miles, something like that. And then ride Sherman, which is 12, 12, okay, it's 12 miles. The rest to equal 43, I think. Yeah, 18 on the road. So it's gonna be a long day. We're hoping to get it done in four hours, so. But it's gonna be fun. So just came up the gorge climb. Sam is leading at this moment. Yep, so at no name. Uh, dang, it is muggy today. I mean, it's gorgeous weather. Sun's not out, thank God. But it's just kind of steamy. Um, okay, so we uh, just finished Rocky River. Uh, I feel good. I think that was an hour 45 with a 10 minute break. So we're, we're setting good time. So. We'll head out and uh, now it's road time. Such a gorgeous day out here. So we made it to Sherman, so we'll go do this now. Sherman is done. Uh, that is three hours and 20 minutes. Uh, uh, complete time from start, from when we started to now. So good with that. Took, we've got about 20 minutes of rest in there. So um, I, we both, me and Sam, both feel good about that. Legs are, uh, yesterday I did a Murph, which was a terrible idea. Uh, if you don't know what that is, that's, uh, 100 pull-ups, 200 push-ups, and 300 squats with two timed mile runs. And uh, so I'm feeling a little bit today, but uh, it's a good time. So, okay, so about a half a mile. Back double cramped, cramping like crazy right now. Uh. Oh, well, uh, that last cramp sucked so bad, but hey, thank you, Sam, for pulling the entire way back. We did it. That was the gentleman's ride. Uh, next time, Sam, uh, we finish with Rocky River. So we, we, do, we do Rocky River, Sherman, and then Rocky River. I like it. So after the, the gentleman's ride, went out and tried to do a mile full effort. I was very impressed with that, but... Um, yeah, it's been six weeks now, and I tried to run on Wednesday, and it, it hurts really bad, so that's why I'm here. I'm gonna go get some x-rays. So let me explain to you what the x-rays and the doctor said. The doctor said I gotta wait four more weeks which is a bummer. I should have went to the doctor earlier. I waited six weeks because I figured they would tell me just to wait six weeks. Because if a stress fracture, you just need to take weeks off. That's what I figured it was. The x-ray showed that my shin bone has like a protrusion on it on the side. The doctor said there's no signs of like a stress fracture, but there is like bone protrusion. It sucks because um, at this moment, I've got like an ace bandage wrap really tight and that helps relieve the pain. But I am a terrible patient. This week is my birthday and so I'm going to do, well, there's a video coming on Wednesday. So check back, adios.